for the first time ever. It is WWE Champion versus WWE Champion. After a controversial finish at SummerSlam. Hook of the leg, Cena's got his foot on the rope. No, Triple H, Triple H. John's foot was on the rope. Apparently it's not gonna matter. CM Punk has declared the undisputed WWE Champion. What the hell? CM Punk and John Cena demand their rematches for Alberto Del Rio's newly won WWE Championship. COO Triple H sets up a match on Raw to decide the new number one contender. At Night of Champions, Alberto Del Rio will defend the undisputed WWE Championship against the man that wins tonight's main event. CM Punk will go one on one with John Cena. Who will go on tonight at Champions and meet Alberto Del Rio for the WWE title? Uh, who knows, but what an amazing atmosphere here tonight on Monday Night Raw. I can't help but wonder which man Alberto Del Rio would like to face at Night of Champions, John Cena or CM Punk? And here's John Cena. He was one step ahead on that one. You know, in my mind, John Cena and CM Punk couldn't be any more opposite. Other than a deep desire to regain the WWE Championship, they have absolutely nothing in common. Well, many consider John Cena to be the ultimate company man, while CM Punk is among the most anti-establishment superstars this organization has ever seen. Well, and the differences aren't necessarily new. Going all the way back to their childhoods, these two superstars have always been opposites. Just look at their choices in music. Now, CM Punk's appreciation of punk music is well documented, while John Cena favors hip-hop. He even released his own album, You Can't See Me. It was awesome. In 2005. Oh. He drops the elbow. Well, typical response from the WWE Universe for John Cena here tonight. You know, no superstar in history draws the emotion out of the WWE Universe like John Cena. He's so polarizing. Yeah, but you know, there's one thing you have to remember. Incredible move by John Cena. Of course. Oh, look at this! Look at this! Cena went for the AA! And Punk elbows to the jaw! Fighting out of it! And he continues those elbows to... to Cena's jaw! Cena's reeling now. Yes! Pump with a big knee to the face. And the cover. Hooks the leg. Oh my gosh. This could be it for Cena. In an ear fall. He's trying to fight back here. Can he do it? Oh man. So close for CM Punk, but no. No, wait. Nice reverse. Falls hard. And there's the reversal from CM Punk. He anticipated that move perfectly. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? This could be big. It's a reversal there. Ooh, John Cena may have it. And Cena drives his fist down. Five knuckles shuffle. You can say all you want to about CM Punk, but in my book, he's just not that good. What? I've been an incredible match. Oh, CM oh, Punk oh, oh. Cena with the shoulders down. Could be in here. Oh. And Cena stays alive. And a roundhouse kick from Punk. That may 
may do it. Cena may be finished. Punk signaling. Time to go to sleep. And Punk could be closing in on the championship. CM Punk could be closing in on the championship. Cena's out, King. No doubt about it. He's and got him Punk. up the GT. CM Punk! This isn't what? over yet! That's what Triple H had said. Oh, oh look, at look at this! The AA from Cena! Hook in the leg! Oh my god! And he got it! Cena wins it! Oh, and look it! Alberto Del Rio! Del Rio assaulting Cena! Attacking Cena! Look at this brutal beatdown now by Alberto Del Rio and the number one contender! Uh, Del Rio trying to send a message to John Cena here tonight. Cena, I don't think he knows where he is, Ken. Oh, look out! Oh, oh. And right to the back of the head! A vicious attack by Del Rio. And it continues. Somebody's got to stop this. And speaking of somebody, look at this! Yeah, there's John Laurinaitis. Uh, he's in charge tonight. Remember, King, he was the one who, uh, who told Triple H Nash had been in a car accident. Triple H left the building, leaving Laurinaitis in charge tonight. Well, I think Laurinaitis lost control of this night a long time ago. He's lost control oh. again because look at Del Rio. Come on, Laurinaitis, get him off of there. Del Rio not having any of this. He is determined to destroy John Cena. Oh, no, watch out, watch out. Oh, my God. Laurinaitis has got to get some control over Alberto Del Rio. It was my destiny to be the WWE Champion. I want to represent every one of you. I mean, this match is over. With respect. This is not the mark of a true champion. With honesty. That's no way for a champion to act. I am a real champion. You are not a champion! I am tired of you bullying people because you say you can. And that golden destiny that you got your hands on, that makes you a target. You're about to find out that your destiny is John Which man is gonna continue the illustrious heritage of the WWE title. Is it going to be John Cena or is it going to be Alberto Del Rio? A yellow Ferrari. I love John Cena's strategy. Kicking this thing off with a little mind games. Think you're the only one who can drive fancy cars down the ring. I stole your Ferrari. How's that make you feel? I can't believe John Cena stole Alberto Del Rio's bright yellow, very expensive sports car and drove it out here tonight. Oh, come on, Michael. It was just a joyride. That car is worth $300,000. That's Grand Theft Auto. Cena really should be arrested. Luthez Press. Great move. And the knuckles connect. Cena with momentum early on. This is the fifth night of Champions Pay-Per-View King, and it should be noted that each event's WWE Championship match has featured John Cena. Yeah, and the only time Cena won heading into tonight was the inaugural event in 2007 when he successfully defended the WWE title in a WWE Championship Challenge match. And speaking of that challenge match, in order to keep the gold, John Cena had to turn back all the other superstars that night. Mick Foley, King Booker, and Randy Orton. Oh man, that's a pretty impressive list if you ask me. Oh, that's devastating. Great offense by John Cena. What's gonna happen now? And he reversed it. Good move there. And he hits the drop kick. What impact.
time the WWE Championship changed hands here in Buffalo was back in December of 2008 when Jeff Hardy defeated champion Edge and Triple H in a triple threat match at Armageddon to cap the incredible move by John Cena. Alberto Del Rio has to be learning now what it means to be in a championship match with John Cena in his never-say-die attitude. Oh, you're right about that. This match is truly emblematic of Night of Champions. What we're witnessing here tonight is great! Alberto Del Rio says that he's going to change WWE forever, that he will replace legacies with his destiny. At this point, though, he's going to have to get through what looks like a very determined John Cena. Oh, that's right. Oh, John Cena is like a machine on Alberto Del Rio right now. It's got to be taking his toll on Del Rio. This match is all about which man will continue the hair. Ladies and gentlemen, John Cena is now a 10-time WWE Champion. Oh, that's great. Let me say it. The champ is here! Well, let's just savor this reaction for a moment. A picture is worth a thousand words right now. And John Cena celebrating like it was the first time he ever won the WWE title. I have the balls to say things that nobody else has the balls to say. Who's really pulling the strings? Is it you? Or is it your bean-headed wife? You don't wear the pants in the family. But you do wear her panties, don't you? You disrespected me as a man. Now, deal with me as a man. So at Night of Champions, no disqualification, punk. Anything goes. It's not if, but when I beat you, you resign as COO at WWE. Done. on Triple H and his family. It started out being about business, now it's personal. And you know what they say, paybacks are hell, and it looks like Triple H is about to put CM Punk through hell. The Cerebral Assassin. The game. And Punk from behind! What? CM Punk from behind attacking Triple H! What audacity! And here we go! Punk wasted little time getting the upper hand! Oh, look out! Into the timekeeper's area! This didn't take long for this to get out of hand, did it? Oh, look out, he's coming over here! Whoa! Wait a minute, Punk, this is our table! Look out! Look out, King! Triple H fighting back now, right out here in front of us! Oh, and Triple H gonna take out all those emotions on CM Punk. What's the out, King? Oh. Come on, guys, please get this back in the ring. Oh, oh, man. Come on, Punk. Game is trying to destroy. CM Punk. Oh, no, no. I'm on the announce table. I think I got my headset back now, but look at this. Go over the pedigree. Punk going for the go to sleep. And Punk escaping. Thank goodness he's back in the ring. Chaos here at ringside. Way too close for comfort, if you ask me. So much on the line here for Triple H. If he loses to CM Punk tonight, he will be forced out as COO of the WWE. Well, you know, this started out as business, but CM Punk made it personal. And right now, Triple H is hoping to end it. This one's not going to resemble a match. This is two men who are going to tear each other apart here tonight. And there's the reversal from CM Punk. he goes under the bottom rope and maybe some order will be restored here 
When CM Punk first came to WWE, he claims Triple H saw him as a pompous, undersized internet darling that couldn't hang with the lights of the game. Well, Triple H doesn't deny it, but he does say CM Punk has a warped internet philosophy on how to get over in this business. Well, according to Triple H, you get over in this business by making sacrifices and busting your ass in the ring every night for the good of the business. Well, isn't that what CM Punk has been doing over the past six years? Uh, it's no disqualification. Anything goes here tonight. You know, Triple H may have the advantage in this type of match. This is his element. No doubt, King. The game has participated in some of the WWE's most brutal matches ever. CM Punk might live to regret that comment about Stephanie wearing the pants in the family. Yeah, and I don't even want to repeat what CM Punk said the game wears under his pants. One thing's for certain, CM Punk is going to leave this arena here tonight bruised and battered, but will he also leave with the victory? Well, that's the question, Cole, but it doesn't look good for him right now. Three! You know, you have to wonder what was going through Triple H's mind when he had to deliver the news to his father-in-law, Mr. McMahon, that he was being... And that's it. He gave everything he had, but it just wasn't enough. Oh, look at the game. Speaking of change, Triple H said he would give it to Punk, but not before kicking his butt first. And that's exactly what he's doing right now. Although I think I need somebody to tell me what a skinny fat ass is. Oh, the punch connects. Here comes some offense from Triple H. Oh, did you see the neck snap back? Cerebral ascends it. He's done. He's setting it up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's 
WWE. Any way you look at it, with all the chaos and with everything that went down in this no disqualification match, this is perhaps one of the greatest matches ever. I don't care who you were rooting for, this match was fantastic.